Welcome back to one of only two countries that has held a race every year since the very first Formula One World Championship in 1950. It is, of course, Italy, one of the great racing nations. And it's time to get underway for the Italian Grand Prix. With top speeds reaching 215 miles per hour, only a few places can challenge Monza's crown as the fastest circuit in F1. Hard braking zones going into the three chicanes make up the majority of the 11 corners on this 3.6 mile circuit. And just in case the slipstream wasn't enough, two DRS zones will help encourage some closer action. Anthony Davidson also joins me in the commentary box today. Let's have a chat about Williams. What do you make of their performance so far this season? Well, the atmosphere within that team seems very positive at the moment. Everyone seems like they're in great spirits and having a lot of fun doing what they do. And that's definitely contributed to the performances we've seen. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole position, edging out Max Verstappen, who'll start from P2. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Bottas, Ricardo, Lando Norris and Sainz, Leclerc, Perez, Gasly and Varsandi, Vettel, Fernando Alonso, Yuki Tsunoda and Raikkonen, Stroll, Giovinazzi, Mick Schumacher and Nikita Mazepin, Latifi and George Russell ends our grid lineup. And with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. Race over, take care of the car on the way in. They made great use of the clear air today then and didn't allow anyone to exploit the slipstream behind them. What a great win here at Monza. What do you think it was, Ant, that gave them the edge over the competition today? 
Without a doubt, the safety car changed everything today. The key to their success was keeping calm and reacting to the situation quickly. We've seen teams in the past throw away wins because they were too hesitant, but here they were decisive and that's allowed them to take the advantage. Mercedes are on top form once again after an excellent race weekend. It's great to see them up on that podium once again. And after this round of the World Championship, here's how things look in the driver's table. That lead at the top of the table has shrunk somewhat today. Now, let's discuss, Ant, who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? Lance Stroll certainly put in an impressive performance today. No doubt his team and fans are extremely proud. Let's move on to the constructors. It was a tough race for our championship leaders who lose ground at the top of the table. Well, that was certainly an incredible weekend of racing. Be sure to join myself and Ant for more exciting Formula One action soon.